Hello everyone, Hiromi here, and this is the Tier 9 Black Fletcher. It's just a Fletcher. <laughs> but really, the only difference here between Fletcher and Black Fletcher, we got Torpedo Reload 1 instead of the Engine Accelerator, which I do enjoy the Engine Accelerator just by constantly using it, but now we got Torpedo Reload. Oh yeah, also AA increase to AA uh, 3, which to be honest, it's just a destroyer. The only ships I, I mean, the only destroyers that can actually work is probably Holland, Friesland, mostly just pan Europeans, but American with that is still not gonna work anyways. All right, the skills, same goes advanced gun director, advanced torpedoes. Actually, why not just use the ship comparison? Because I haven't used that for a while. And knowing that I have over 500 ships, it takes forever to load. <laughs> Alright, let's grab this. Alright, so what we got here is Black Fletcher and Fletcher. So you can tell there's a difference. Torpedo Reload 1, Engine Accelerator 1, and Air Defense Alert 3 instead of Air Defense Alert 2. You still remain, you still keep the smoke, which is nice. And then the stat wise, it's Black Fletcher is just slightly faster, but in terms of everything else, it's exactly the same. All right, so now that, whoops, so now that Black Fletcher has Torpedo Reload skill, this is probably where if I can find the commander. Not Sims. There we go, Harley Burke, Torpedo Reload, this is where he's going to be useful. Now I don't even have Engine Overload, but we're going to keep it anyways because that's pretty much, we're going to keep this for other ships. But in terms of Black Fletcher, here are the skills that would be used for Black Fletcher. And let's set up the build. Historic camo, there's no any specialties. And the difference between the two, either advanced torpedoes or advanced gun director. Uh, let's just play a little more aggressive, so advanced torpedo it is. Alright, so we got three destroyers and anchorage and three battleships. No carriers. After all the carrier matches I went through. Battle starts. All right, right straight to Charlie, and then we'll use uh, AP for this one because I will definitely going against destroyers. Now let's drop the this here. There's two destroyers on B. Oh, I have a destroyer on my side somewhere undetected, which is not a good sign. Okay, Kitakaze. That's why. Kitakaze is just right there. Hiding under the smoke. Is he standing there? Okay, I was about to say. Let's just go ahead and push this Kitakaze. There's the torpedoes. You just use all the torpedoes, which means I can actually fully engage. I need to push away because there's no cars here. And then 
mean, I saw there's... Yeah, the Iowa is not gonna last long, so I'm just gonna ignore that. Uh, AP. Yep, overshoot. You gotta love the arcs of uh, players that are trying to get used to North Car. It's just... It's difficult, trust me. I, I play North American battleships or cruisers. It struggles. Like, if you don't know the arcs, you will struggle. And once you actually get used to it, it can be painful. Enemy team captured the area. All right, now let's get this Norcar. That kid of Kaze just survived the day, so let's just go ahead and let's just do a bonsai. Let's just do a bonsai. Let's do that. All right, one fire. I'm gonna keep the torpedoes, and hopefully the main guns are fired, which means I have the opportunity. Enemy team captured the area. There's Yugamo on the left. I will keep that in mind. Nice shot. Our team captured the area. And that should take care of him. Torpedoes. There we go. Uh, I want to keep myself narrowed so that Anchorage thinks I am shooting one side only. And I think that was just... Target hit. Okay. Yep. Now, GTFO. Just go ahead, just use my rear turrets only. Because if I'm just exploding the wrong side, I'm going to get a little hurt. And those turrets are definitely going towards me, which is fun. Now I just play the dodging game. <laughs> Let my team actually do the damage while I just run. It's just a game of just keep going until Anchorage decides to switch to another target. Which I don't know if he is targeting to a different ship. The answer is no. Oh, he actually got a hit this time. <laughs> as much as Anchorage is trying to kill me, he is way too distracted on the focus of the rest. Like, you can tell. He is fully dedicated to kill me. And that's what happens you're fully dedicated to kill Destroyer. Alright, all that's left is that Kitakaze, which Kitakaze is probably right at the corner of the map. Because that's the same Kitakaze I fought and almost killed him. Alright, there you are Kitakaze. Thank goodness I was able to use that. Definitely the torpedoes I have it since has been launched. Enemy yep, just like that. And he's out. There we go. Okay. First impressions. Pretty good. It's a unique. You don't have the speed, but you got the torpedo reload. Uh, going towards that uh, North car definitely helps with the damage. But in terms of just... Playing a Fletcher, it's this is a usual destroyer. Like it's as long as you can drop torpedoes, it can be fun. But overall, it's just not so. Fun. Would I get this Black Fletcher? Well, if you have Arleigh Burke, then yes. If you yeah, Arleigh Burke is probably one of the commanders that has the torpedo reload. Black Fletcher, uh, Summers. Recall, yep, Somers has Torpy Reload and Mogador. If I have that, there you go. So, of those three destroyers, Arleigh Burke works. So, if you want to get Black Fletcher, Arleigh Burke is the commander uh, that you want to get first. So, if you have Arleigh Burke, get the Black Fletcher, but overall, Somers.
Um, if you don't like the guns, but you rather play torpedo boat, Summers is the choice. Black Fletcher is a mix of two. If you like guns and torpedoes, that's good for you. And then Mogador is, well, Mogador. Anyways, that's enough for me today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe to my channel. And I'll be looking forward to seeing your SEs next time. Until then, Jane.